forewarn weather with cutting edge technology for the most up to the minute forecast in Southeast Michigan. Okay, let's dig into that seven day forecast. Lots of folks visiting in town, lots of outdoor plans, and we need to see how that weather's gonna shape up for us, especially if people are traveling on Sunday. Yeah, that's gonna be the big fly in the ointment, if you will. Tomorrow looks good, tonight looks mm -hmm. good. So all the football games going on without a hitch. The snow and our first accumulating snow looks to move in by the time we get to Sunday. That's the big headline out of the entire seven day forecast. While we are going to be staying cold for quite a while, the snow will start to add up by the time we get to late Sunday night, but then we also keep the chance of some snow showers into the forecast. Those don't arrive until we get to the first half of next week. Today, though, lots of sunshine. Tower cam over at Ford Field or Michigan State will be taking on Penn State here in just a few hours. No concerns from Mother Nature this afternoon, but most everybody into the low to mid 30s. 34 right now here in Detroit, 32 over in Ann Arbor, 32 right now in Port Huron, and 34 right now as you work over into Adrian. Once you factor in the cold front that moved through yesterday. Most everybody running about 10 to 15 degrees colder this afternoon, and we will keep those cold temperatures around for a, the better portion of the next seven days. High pressure off to the north controlling our forecast. That's giving us our northwesterly flow, bringing in that colder air today. But I'm watching an area of low pressure out over the Four Corners region. This is going to move off to the east over the next couple of days and bring us our chances of accumulating snow by the time we get to the end of the weekend on Sunday. So for tonight, we'll keep Keep mainly clear skies until roughly around midnight tonight, but the further we get to sunrise, those clouds increase as we head throughout early Saturday morning. By lunchtime on Saturday afternoon, kickoff over in Ann Arbor, we are dry, but we are cloudy, and we keep the dry weather into the forecast into the first part of Sunday as well. 7 o'clock Sunday morning, we start off dry, but after lunchtime, all bets are off. Snow moves into the region Sunday afternoon into Sunday evening. 1 o'clock Sunday afternoon, most everybody socked in with some light to moderate snow across the region and it winds down by 9 to 10 o'clock Sunday night before the snow showers start to kick in overnight Sunday night into early on Monday morning and we keep those snow showers in the forecast for the first half of next week. Before it's all said and done, our first accumulating snow is going to be on the lighter end of things. Most everybody right around an inch or so before it's all said and done, we could see some places up to maybe an inch and a half of snow. So a good time to start breaking out the snow blowers, the snow shovels, for an early preview of more snow that we could see over the next two to three months. So for tonight, we will keep some cloud cover into the forecast, especially the closer we get to sunrise. Temperatures dropping into the 20s overnight tonight and early tomorrow morning. And then for the Ohio State versus Michigan game, it's at noon kickoff over in Ann Arbor. 20s in the morning, 30s in the afternoon. It's going to be cold any way we slice it. Winter weather into the forecast for the first half of next week with the accumulating snow on Sunday. Snow showers stick around Monday through Wednesday. We dry things out by the time we get to Thursday.